I'm completely overwhelmed, thunderstruck. Uh, it's kind of like a head-on collision of shock and joy. And I still haven't touched down. Uh, it's going to take me a while to recover, but uh, I couldn't be happier and couldn't be uh, more grateful. It's a, it's a wonderful honor. Tell us about the moment you found out. Well, the moment I found out, I was sitting alone at my desk at home uh, and uh, with my headphones on, listening to the, the streaming of the program. Uh, and I just kind of took the headphones off and did a bit of a dance around the room. But uh, yeah, it was uh, quite a shock. I was not expecting that at all. I kind of thought I, I was going to be the, the third book voted off. And it didn't happen. Tell us about your, the, the amount of support you've received. Oh, well, the support from my readers uh, and my publisher and my agents and the CBC and certainly the support I had from Ali Velshi, the chief business correspondent for CNN, who was my stalwart defender during the Canada Reads debates. Uh, I don't think it would have happened without him. He had a real grasp of the novel and how to present it in, I think, a compelling way. Uh, and he's just so articulate and persuasive and such a good guy with a great sense of humor that I can't imagine a better person to have defended the best laid plans in the Canada Reads debates.